Welcome to Rideau River. hot outside and I'm waiting for the first ice cube. We have ice cubes! Fitting a steak dinner on a little plate like this looks kind of funny. Looks good though. Ah. What? Oh. I colored my own point? I was trying to show off for the camera and screw that <laughs> up. Oh, I got him. So, first time I've ever dropped any of my equipment, dropped my camera off of the top of this tripod, it fell directly glass first, lens first. Thankfully I had this on and uh, that took the blunt of the force, so it should be fine. Okay, you can't see anything. over there, seagulls. Exactly what they are. Oh, the camera's cutting through the fog now. So right over here, I just caught a glimpse of the mama wood duck. And then 
some little babies stumble off that way. So it's 9 a.m. I thought it was going to be a little too late to see any wildlife. I really wasn't expecting much, but I've got a pair of wood ducks, which I thought I saw some babies, but now I'm not really too sure. I've got a, I think a Merlin falcon up in the trees right there. And then I can't make out what I, what it was. It was either a hawk. It's got like a really sharp beak. It was a lot bigger than the Merlin. I really couldn't tell because it was right up against the extremely harsh sunlight. So. I'm just gonna hang out here for a couple more minutes, see what we get. I don't know what that is. New bird. Robin, don't get distracted. Oh, he flew to the next tree. Oh, there's two of them. This is the ultimate bird spot. There's several different species up in these trees. And a nest. I should have recorded it, but I just set up for the most difficult top-down photo with this lens, and that is awesome. The yeah. Oh, he didn't like that. Where are you going, dude? He is massive. He is so much bigger than we thought. Yeah, see, the that is too close. So I had to hold it way up. It's so difficult to see it with the bright sun. He's a little bit further away now, so. Where was it? Oh, there he is. Okay, so I focused in on him and then zoom, zoom, zoom. Oh, <laughs> oh my God, okay. Check out this custom shirt Jamie made me. You got my two guys. Bye. Is it that? That was funny. I don't know how much we recorded, but we made it to that bridge over there. And then it overheated. Classic GoPro.
<laughs> it didn't focus. I am incredibly sad right now. I lost my pancakes. Where are we off? We're Where off to we a trail. To? Ferguson? Okay, we're going to Ferguson. I think we're all a little hot and tired of this trail. And here's our map to find out where we're going next. I'm not sure this was a map. Anyways, we're just gonna continue following Blue until we get out of here. We found absolutely nothing out here, but we did try to go out in the middle of the day. Sarah's on the A6000 with automatic setting, settings, so we have no idea what she's filming or what audio she's catching. <laughs> mm. All right, we're trying this again, heading back out to that Osprey and Wood Duck spot. So I got a beaver across the water over there. So I realized it's probably not a beaver because it's very small and that definitely looks like a muskrat tail. just got the great blue heron flying by. There's a lot of really far away animals. But I just heard the Merlin's call again. More light is important now, so I'm taking the teleconverter off because it's getting pretty dark. All right. It's, uh, it's 7 a.m. I got up relatively early-ish to go check out that new part of the trail and see what we get today. Ducklings really don't seem to mind me. So I'm coming around to the other side so that the sun's behind my back. Feels so out of season for them, but we're gonna head back down the uh, main trail and continue exploring and see what else we might find this morning.
yeah, that should hopefully keep the kitchen relatively dry and give us a little more shelter. We'll see how it goes. Storm's rolling in. Mmm. It smells really good. It's just sausage. What is this called again? Pinocchi. Pinocchi? Well, it's absolutely delicious. Thank you. seeping into the tent. The stuff's under the bed. And our roof is leaking. Camera stuff's all packed and in the trunk there to keep dry while the storm passes by. And uh, we're off to Ottawa today. So I probably won't record much of that. I'll catch you guys later when we're back at camp and hopefully dry, we'll see. For $25, um, $25 for two hours. I'm actually up before sunrise. This is the last day here. So it's time to try and bring all my wildlife knowledge, like everything I've learned about the park here, and uh, try to get my best photos. We'll see. But I'm gonna give myself a minute and enjoy this coffee. Tamer on 20 millimeter. On the old A6000. So I got a nice little backup landscape lens for today. When have I ever photographed a sunrise? Wild. One more with the wide angle. This is the wobbliest dog ever. I woke up at 5 a.m. to a wood thrush just singing the loudest song. All right, let's see what's up ahead here. bug spray on thick last night, but it didn't reply, reapply this morning. Oh God, so many mosquitoes down here. I had to tie my shoes and I got surrounded. I'm really sick of the GoPro or overheating extremely quickly. That's incredible. There was a deer right in that lighting. There's the scene for you guys. That's what a deer would have just been in. God, the mosquitoes are so bad. I was both, I'm both so sad and so excited that there was a deer back there. I was really hoping to see one along this trail in the deeper woods. 
finally made it out of the deepest part of the woods. Damn, it was buggy in there. in these trees. I didn't notice them until he took flight and I got in-flight shots of them going across the water here. Okay. Let's finish this trail once and for all. Just went through the biggest spider web. Oh, it's still sticky. Gross, dude. I guess nobody's walked this way. a little slug hanging from the tree from his silk. This is the official end of the trail. You are here. All right, we hiked all of that today. Nice. With the zoom lens at 200, I just got a compressed photo. I tried to stitch it together. I'm just working on photos, but I forgot. We gotta do the sticker. Make sure I get it straight this time. Straight-ish anyways. Another provincial park complete.